There's the visitors who do through one one against Whitby Town on Monday. It's a long throw into the box. Header on goal. Offside. First opportunity. Put into the back of the net, but uh, offside flag was raised. In uh, blue shirts, black shorts. Here's the visitors again through Simington, attacking through the middle, but Ferkel gets in and knocks the ball towards Wright, who takes it in his stride here. Max Wright is into the area, shrugs off the attention of the defender, squares it! Oh, he's got it wide! What a move down the right-hand side from Scarborough Lesic, but Billy Logan putting the shot over the bar. All came from the pace of Max Wright as he scampered down the right, pulled the ball across, but Logan just couldn't find the... Uh, Back in the net, he's working to another corner from the right hand side into the six yard box. Headed away by Scarborough now. Logan takes it, in, takes it on. And now Dean, who have started well in these uh, early stages, it's now right chooses this time to cut in and feeds Valentine in the area here for David Valentine. Trying to get the ball across, but it's uh, played behind. Good early pressure here from the home side. Here's a corner into the uh, area, cleared away by working to number four, Dan Wordsworth. Now it's right again over on the right. Dean into the area, headed anywhere. Now Logan with a dancing header, which goes all the way through to Taylor in the working to goal. But excellent start this by Steve Kittrick's side. Ferkel intercepts, right again. Valentine, right with the ball in, Billy Logan. Running on to it, but again it's headed behind for a corner. Michael Coulson to take this corner. He swings it in. There's uh, Valentine with the free header. Goes up in the air and well caught by Aaron Taylor. It's Merritt into the feet of Dean. Luke Dean goes down, referee gives a free kick. Now, Derek Wade, the man in black this afternoon. Here he is, Coulson. Swings it in right footed. Logan with the header initially and then hooked over the bar by Nathan Valentine. Narrow angle for the Borough midfielder, but he's in a rich vein of uh, scoring goals and wasn't far off with that one. Played upfield by Aaron Taylor, headed forward by Meris. Valentine has uh, Douglas on his back foot, shrugs him off. And now Dean shapes to shoot. Great effort and a great save by Aaron Taylor to turn it behind for another for, for a corner. Dean had one thing on his mind and he carried it forward and hit it right footed. But uh, a good tip over the bar by Aaron Taylor with his right hand. But it is another Scarborough Athletic corner with Steve Kittrick's side have certainly started this game the better. Back post turbo in the header. On behind for another ball corner. <laughs> Trying to make the breakthrough here with the opening goal. Coulson with a corner to the back post again. Turnbull can't get ahead of the defender and it's uh, behind for a goal kick. It's Tom Taylor. Thurkill wins a header. Coulson takes the ball down. He's got some space here, Michael Coulson. Goes past the ball defender, gets a shot away, but he can't get the power behind it. And it uh, rolls wide on the target. Connor In it goes. Header on. Good save by. Tom Taylor didn't have to move the Borough keeper. 50-50 ball this one and both sides challenging for it. Working to the merge with it and now they're on the attack through the middle. Nice ball over to the right hand side. Scott Allison scampers onto it. Cuts inside, shoots. Oh, good save, slow down by Tom Taylor. Meris for 
for the home side. Into Coulson. Now Hewitt. Maris again. Borough trying to play it at the back. Good pressure from Workington. And it's the visitors who get the ball and Borough being a lapse at the back. In it comes. Header on goal. Saved by Tom Taylor. Here's Valentine's shot on goal. Not far off the target there from Nathan Valentine. Head on by Logan. Here's Coulson. Keeper with him. Keeper gets a good block on it. The ball eventually runs out for a throw in. To work in turn. Another good opening for Scarborough Athletic and another opportunity missed in front of goal. Coulson over on the right. Chips the ball in. Turnbull attacks the header. Now Luke Dean over on the left. Sends the ball in. Headed away again by Workington. It could fall here for right on the volley. Oh, good stop by Aaron Taylor in the Workington goal. Yeah, Max Wright with uh, a good strike from the edge of the area. It's uh, Scarborough going now attacking towards the far end here, down towards the uh, south stand. Here's uh, Luke Dean, knocks it forward. Billy Logan into Valentine. Good run here for Nathan Valentine. He's in on goal. The midfielder shoots. Hits the keeper, but it rolls into the back of the net. And for a half a lead. 1 0 to. After all the pressure in the first half, it's Valentine who kicks out Spur in the second half with a cool finish to make his guard athletic off, working to nil. Billy Logan now to Max Wright, he cuts inside here, Wright goes down, free kick to Steve Kittrick's side. Here's the free kick. Coulson to take. He's going to hit it right footed into the area. Coulson chips it in, back post, header Hewitt straight up. Aaron Taylor. Another great opportunity here for Borough. Oh, and the other end now is the working to number 12, Jack Ryan, who's been brought on half time. He's working to the Borough area, it strikes the arm of Sam Hewitt, perhaps, but. Cleared away, now Valentine puts it towards Logan. Nice touch that by Logan, trying to find Wright on the... Charging through the middle, here's Max Wright. Moved out to the right, he's past the defender, Wright! Good tackle by Wood, to take the ball behind. It is definitely more like it from Steve Kittrick's side. Oh, Turnbull, just a force of goalwards. Poor ball across the 18 yards box, and now Nathan Valentine takes it over table halfway. Max Wright, and he's uh, last game in a Borough shirt for a, a while. He's got a three game suspension. Luke Dean will have in the middle. Now it's Sam Joel who's in on goal here. Joel, that's the fire across the top. Cross goal, that's wide on the target. Right 
Rugby's been on the attack once again here in his second half. The lead one at the moment is Colton. Drifts inside. Back to Dean. Now Merris. Dave Merris on the charge. Forced another good save. Right hooks it back across Logan there, but it's uh, made away from goal. And behind for another corner. crowd going as well this uh, dominating attacking performance for the Sea Dogs as they look to make it through to the second qualifying round here's Colton shrugged off the attentions of Matthew Douglas now back to right into third kill, ball across is headed away only as far as Dean. Now Daly. Over on this left hand side. Ross Daly gives it to Merris. A low cross. Coulson. Can he turn? Feet. Valentine. Logan could be in here. It's a bit of a scramble in the box. Now third kill gets ahead of uh, Sam Joe. For a half of the again, the cap's on the edge of this Workington area. Here's Max Wright. Oh, just wide of the target. Coming off for Emile Sinclair. Sinclair is returned from a, a layoff through injury. Former Knox Forest striker. by Taylor, gives it to Osborne over on the left to spur a sub, just holds up play a little bit, let's uh, play it on, Osborne still with it, over to right, ball chipped in by uh, the winger, now goes past the defender, back to right into Daly, one of the two needs to shoot, Sinclair loses it. On the counter here, working to they got some space down this right hand side. It's Allenson. Ooh, tries to curve it into the bottom corner and Borough just about to see it off, but one in time for Borough. In comes a working to corner at Nippos and it's in the crossbow and bounces down. Nothing given by the assistant. He was number nine, he went to the header on goal. Nothing there, Emil Sinclair with a chance to finish it. He's hit the post. And they're bounced into the grateful arms of Aaron Taylor in the Workington goal. <laughs> in comes the throw, and he doesn't really get it right, but it could fall nicely here. But a danger man on the line. Allison goes behind front of a corner. <laughs> in comes a corner, it's uh, through everyone. And uh, taking a touch off of our defender. So another opportunity here for the visitors and the keeper is up for these corners. In it comes. Now Max 
right into the area. Shoots! Oh! Behind. For a goal kick. Another. Great move by Borat. In the ball comes the back post, it's headed away over the bar, and it's all time. Borat. Triumph here at the Flamingo Land Stadium. 1 0 to Steve Kittrick's side. It was a goal just a minute into the second half through Nathan Valentine, which has seen Borough in the hat for the second qualifying round in their 500th game at Scarborough Athletic. It's Borough who come out on top.